Welcome back to another episode of Drink or Tell the Truth. My name is La Cesar, and today, darling, I have Queen Mother. <laughs> darling, she is my Bianchan. The most humble, unproblematic, <laughs> media personality, presenter, Mamelene, wife, mother, Nandi Madina! <laughs> oh! oh. 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 I can't wait for the question. Because ah. yeah. <laughs> you have nothing on me. No, actually, like, I was like, oh my gosh, we have Nandi. What are we going to ask Nandi? Because, wow, babe. Oh, clean, man. Whoa. But anyway, for okay. those that are watching the show for the first time, we have selected questions that I haven't seen and Nandi hasn't seen. We're going to be asking each other those questions. And if one refuses to answer, they have to drink this beautifully mixed concoction. It's not alcohol. Like it's mixed with a tea baggy, hot sauce, milk, egg yolk. What's that white stuff? Is that rotten milk? Because that's not milk. No, that's I think it's like feta. They put feta in there. Oh, Let's go. All right, let me begin. Mm. Ah. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Rank these people I'm about to mention from worst to best, right? Uh, and you're ranking their fashion sense. Paul Tusi, Bonang Mateba, <laughs> and Muhali. Oh, that's actually quite easy. Okay, first of all, I have to put it to say, but Paul Nyang Tai, and I'm Nyang Nyang Tai, Ula Sis, and then Luna Stein. I'll say Muhali third, Muhali, because obviously I don't relate to his style, so that's not too bad. <laughs> and I think like he's still new to the style game but i know he's got a lot to offer there, there's try, potential yeah. yeah there's you know you need a few more years to show that no you really understand this fashion thing next one um oh okay let me tell you so the the one is very elegant sleek you no. know sharp <laughs> just ta, ta, ta. and the other is eclectic you can't uh... okay Bonang, I'd say you second, and Pearl to see you number one. And I'll tell you why. Why? Because Pearl has variety. I've seen her do that like elegant, sleek look, but I've seen her also do her ratchet where she twerks for me look. <laughs> and for that, Mkaiwami, well done, you're number one. <laughs> we'll take it, we'll take it. You're okay. 10. Oh, this was the funniest thing ever. Why am I now? <laughs> I love this question. Thank you, content director. In 2018, guys, la la la. In 2018, if your sister didn't call you out about not buying a house, would you have come out clean? Why have you come back? Okay, to be honest, to be honest, um, if Kanye didn't call me out. <laughs> but lesson learned, like for me, like lesson learned. Sure. Like, because. You know journalists, they 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 could do that, they could do that, and it's just gonna spiral out of like, control. something control, and then I would look even way bad, you yes. know, worse. I slew. Absolutely. Ooh. So I kudos, some other time. kudos to Kanye. Thank yes. you so much for Thank calling you. me out. <laughs> so <laughs> so basically, una manga. No, you just, no. Let me tell you. Yeah, let me tell okay. you what happened. Yeah. I moved into my new apartment, right? Okay. And I posted. Man's apartment, your apartment. My apartment. Oh. I'm a woman of class, I'm a woman of standard. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> I moved into my apartment mm. and I had posted from Soweto to Santin. Mm. And everyone was like, congratulations on the house. Yes, and I, I ran with it. Them. Yes, and I ran with it. I was like, oh my God, I got a house. Ah, <laughs> y'all. And then just like, she calls me, she's like, how? Oh, <laughs> Bani? I'm like, no, but my country is number one Nandi. They say congratulations. <laughs> Ingi, as they speak, on the Kuluma. And then I was like, I dare you. Because then, back then, we were still like trying to figure out how to in our relationship. So I was like, I dare you. Like, like are you going to really throw me under yeah. the bus? And she did it. I was like, oh. And we didn't speak like for good months. Like, we were just like not talking to each other. Yeah, and absolutely. So, like, can you shout out to you? Can you say, yo, hey. Anyway, between these three males I'm about to mention, oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> who are the best male musicians in this country? Between Black Coffee, okay. <laughs> Zex Bantwini, mm -hmm. <laughs> and uh, please, uh, we must check consistency, music, heat, all yeah. of those things, and Maporisa. 
Ja! Nee. Guys, this list. I'm gonna rank it like this, because my Purisa I know from way back. Is Temba it? is the truth, yeah. People don't know that it's, it's I've known him for like, you're almost a decade. Temba, as I know him, my Purisa is the truth, as in when I say his talent is what he shows. He plays instruments, he produces, he, he, sings. Uh, he sings, he's versatile, he goes from genre to genre. He is absolutely incredible, but also he's just a cool guy. Zags, obviously, uh, content direct will silly, but it's fine. Mm. Zags is my husband, the nicest human being, going for Harvard for entertainment mm. and sports. And of course, he has a hit song, Osama. <laughs> Even when it was not released, it was trending. <laughs> Coffee, cool. Um, also, uh, beautiful legacy, beautiful uh, music and collaborations. Cool. Ranking yes, cool. Black Coffee 3, Zegs 2, Maparisa 1. I stick by my truth. Thank you very <laughs> Thank much. You. <laughs> Let's Wait, go. why coffee number 3? <laughs> Next question. <laughs> because I want to be original like the song of summer. If your parents were still alive, do you think that they would allow you to date politicians? But didn't you say you dated a politician? <laughs> 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 but guys, at the end of the day, there are people just because of their standard in their life. Oh, why, why, why? Why is it that I'm a president, we can't date them? I'm a politician, we can't date them. Why? 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 Because Mina, I want to shoot for the stars. Oh. But then what age group is this? Because yeah. most of them come quite old. Yeah. <laughs> what age group is this? I speak my truth because I believe positions should not determine who you date you date yes. who you're attracted to True. and me i don't date because you're a politician i date because you are who you are mm. and then i find out that oh you're a politician <laughs> oh, okay. oh you're a doctor oh, okay to answer uh, my parents <laughs> they wouldn't cut in eyes apple didn't fall far from the tree <laughs> And that's my statement, and I stick beside it. That's fair enough. Period. There you go. <laughs> Next question. So, from the ladies I'm about to mention, okay, uh, you're not following one of them, and want to know why? Ne? So, <gasps> you must rank these entry extras from best to worst. <gasps> Nomza Mombata, okay, which you don't follow. Okay, we know. Okay, and why? Yes. Bushy Samuels. Yes. Jessica Nkosi. Who is the one that you watch on the screen? You say, ah, we na, ah, we eat you when you take a take a we na, ah, ah. For me, Percy, I can tell you uh, my favorite actress, Jessica Nkosi. Okay. Yeah, absolutely. So and where I do you, like, where do you put her? All beautiful women, all very talented. No, number one. Who are? Hi, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, get her, get her. Nazo. Drink, you said not drinking. Yeah, Nazo. Hi, yeah, 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 you're holding your mouth for 10 seconds. Oh, this is a trick. All of it. All, all, all. Let's go. Oh. Mm. 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 Okay. Nine, mm -hmm. Eight. Seven. Five. Four. Three. Two. Two. What? As females, you need to unite. Yeah. You're all as males, I'm a Ramadota. As males, I males, I. They've been empowered for years. It's time to need to empower each other. So I love you all. Enjoy maybe a sip of water to so you. It's actually quite nice. Huh? It's your yeah. It's quite what? nice. <laughs> <laughs> maybe because I eat baby food. I'm joking, I don't eat it, but you know, being a mom, like, yeah, bread. Right, it's actually not that, actually not that bad at all. I promise you, you guys can have, no, unless no, if you no, put no, other. No, 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 no. Sorry. Right, next. From the following productions mm. I'm about to mention, rank them from best to worst and why. The River, The Queen, or Deep City? I love The River. The River is quite like. Ah, quality! Unemployed! There you go! The River gives you that, like when you watch it, especially on DSTV Catch Up, whatever it may be. Yeah. Like, it needs that cinematic. You know, but why? Like, the other ones don't give you that cinematic. It doesn't. Blah, 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 blah. I, I, would, I, I think you guys can also agree to me on in the comments. Like, okay. like it's. So the others aren't. 
Obviously. No, and they're very raw. Like the other ones are very raw. Like they're short standard. That's the okay, term of film. But I'm not young after many years. Good morning, Yawas. The river number one. I love okay. the storyline. There's even like an LGBT storyline. Oh, wow. I love okay. that for them. Okay. Number two has to be um, the Queen, <laughs> <laughs> because you know I love the Queen. Yes. Um, Brutus reminds me of my brother Lungile. Okay. Like the band around it, and just how the Queen always just consistently comes up with great scripts. I love mm. their writing. Okay, Third you one, safe. Third one, Deep City. I haven't watched it because it's just a little bit ghetto for me. <laughs> it's a little bit ghetto for me. I'm like, girl, I don't want to watch about like the hood. I come from the hood. I don't go back to the hood. Uh uh-uh. uh. I don't know. To be very honest, I've I've never watched Deep City, so just, I don't just know. Just like Inubu, but I'm gonna try. Inubu Hostel. I'm like, oh. <laughs> who would you never ever want to work with again in this industry? <gasps> Um, it, to be honest, it was more people behind the scenes, some of the execs. You know, there's a lot of casting couch. Yeah, so if you're not one of those girls, then they like clubs you. Shit. Yeah, if you okay, got no, you're status, deleting. We want famous. Famous. <laughs> that was good. Uh, no, no one. I no one I ever worked with. I love you all. Even even on a big set, there was no one who. Even a Beyonce. Do you know who the biggest divas are? Who? It's like this content director who's writing these questions. <laughs> you are dragging my content director. But it's the people behind the scenes. People don't know about that stuff. How do you think things get leaked and stuff? You know like about Mohali trying to justify their lives. And what? It's the people behind the scenes who are more dramatic than me and you. We get along. That's the truth. And then yes, sometimes uh, you get, you know, we have tips. But I know someone like myself in the industry and you know, I get along with everyone. So no, I've had a great ride. I have a great time. Thank you. I am blessed, man. It's like tender, man. Where now? Oh, it's not about, it's not about <laughs> me here. Okay, it's your turn. All right. From these soccer players, yeah. without to mention, <laughs> who's chef? Wouldn't you mind waking up next? George. <laughs> George Lebesi. Who? George Lebesi. Yes. yes. Temingo si lo. Oh, Andy Lejani. Hi, boss. I'm at your lunch. <laughs> <laughs> there you go! Ah. Ding, 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 Mr. Lodge! Mm-mm. Your chest, I hope, is no. ready. No. But aren't you friends with Natasha? So you're that friend? Ja- no. Oh. <laughs> Natasha. Ah, uh, you know, Natasha. This is how your friends roll, and it always happens like this. No, Those shame. closest to you no, are going to take your man. No, she has to. Uh, <laughs> yeah, but even, to be honest, even Natasha and I, we've unfollowed each other on all platforms. Oh, okay. So. <laughs> okay, so you heard it, yeah. So it's on! <laughs> no! Me on! <laughs> Actually, cut the cameras. No, no. I thought and you keep that. You don't decide, you keep that. That is the content you want. Thank you. Trending in 54321 when this comes out. Thank you very much. Okay. Okay. You were once a musician, right? Yes. And you made a hit song mm. with KO. Mm. What was the worst encounter you had to come across when you guys went gigging? KO's really professional. He's actually the one guy in the industry who's really professional. Like, when dog was a. We've only done like, what, three, four gigs uh, together because obviously our schedules are oh, hey, all of the best. You're booked but and busy. Absolutely, but he's an incredible person. He's also very professional. Okay, let's go. Sorry, next question. Bonus time. Is it bonus time? Ladies first. I feel like my bonus is too easy, so you may want to start. Uh-uh. <laughs> Ladies first. <laughs> A season. What has been the craziest thing your sister has ever done? You're gonna, you're gonna rank them. Three. Three? Craziest, top three things. Top three. The craziest things that Kanye has done. Yes. One thing about Kanye, she lives her life. Like, yes. Like a bicycle, like a movie. <laughs> like, and she's a steering. She's a steering. Kanye's an all, like, go all in. If she is in love with you, she will literally, like, close her house, like, mm. s- not sell everything, but she'll storage everything mm. and then start from zero with you mm. to the top. That's crazy for me. I'm like, girl, yeah. I told my man, I said, babes, I come with 50, you come with 50, we build together Absolutely. to the top. That's not zero, zero, you know? Mm. Number two, Kanye is like crazy. <laughs> like, you put it like that. Like, we'll be sitting <laughs> like this, and then if something doesn't sit well with her, 
Uh, she will stand on top of the table and she can <laughs> say, fuck, 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 fuck now. And then the third one has to be recently what happened mm. when they were um, with her partner in Dubai. Mm. <laughs> in Dubai! In, in a thong! In a thong! And she was in Dubai in a thong! <laughs> in a yacht! In a yacht! And then um, she just decided that I need to be in Zanzi. I don't care if my suitcase is in Dubai, <laughs> my clothes. I will see when I get to South Africa how I get my stuff. And you know what? That's honorable. I love that she puts herself first. Yeah. And I think a lot of females can actually learn from that. I also want to give a huge shout out to my husband's ex. I love you and you are number one. They just forced me to put you in two. I'm giving you a bonus question. Oh, damn. Okay. <laughs> I was trying to distract you. <laughs> your opinion. <right>? Yeah. <laughs> About your, your husband's hit song, Osama. Our favorite DJ. DJ Black Coffee said your husband's song is not original. So what's the question? The question is that is your husband's song original? And how did that make you feel <laughs> when International Black Coffee said that song <laughs> is not an original one? First of all, I'll answer the first part of the question. Of course it's an original. It was original and how I felt about that, I think, without entertaining it, the song is actually a reflection of where everyone should be. We should all be positive. We should all be happy for one another. Especially as black people, we cannot afford to divide and rule. All of us can shine. Thank you very much. Like, I want to know this beauty My man, when your head... Well, no, my sister... It's funny, because I speak to my sister all the time, and for those who don't know, my sister's a psychiatrist. Mm -hmm. And there's... And I, I hate to be so deep in a show like this, but I think it's important for people watching. A lot of us have childhood traumas and really need to review and, and seek help and therapies and whatever. I'm saying all of us, you know? And so when we work on ourselves, you know, we become better people. I have no issue with anyone. Um, so we must just work surprised. on ourselves because in <laughs> my childhood there are uh, traumas. Unani injiri le witi uni trauma we na. So do you see me now? Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> this is Drink a Tug of Truth. My Drink name is Asuze and Drink this is Nandi Mandida. Oh! oh. 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 See you on the next episode, baby. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you on the next season of Drink or Tell the Truth. Season two, baby, to Africa. <laughs>